He kissed me like his sister, and I knew I was alone again. I knew I'd never stopped being alone in the first place, and maybe I never would. Just two weeks ago, he'd been chasing me like he was a hunter, and I was the prize he'd been searching for his entire life. You're so beautiful, John would text me out of nowhere in the middle of the day. A smile would bloom on my face. I'd blush. I'd feel this heat in my chest and this wonderful, terrible hope growing in me. I'd feel myself start to fall. I could fall in love with you, he whispered after the first time we made love, had sex, hooked up. Whatever you want to call it, it was amazing. I wanted him from the very first moment we met, but I made him wait. I wanted him to feel like he earned me. But it was our fourth date, and we were kissing on the couch, and I inhaled the good masculine smell of him and felt the strength in his arms, and I felt so safe and protected and desired. And afterwards, we lay there tangled in each other. He ran his fingers through my hair as I lay my head against his chest and listened to his heartbeat and let myself believe in some way, maybe, just maybe it was beating for me. And we had two perfect weeks before you know what happened. Two perfect weeks of flirty and sexy texts and laughing in bed and talking in vague terms about the soft focus, far off future and letting the walls I'd built around my heart, brick after bitter brick, start to fall. And then you know what happened. And 20 passionate texts a day turned to 10 boring ones. And I can't wait to see you turned to I've been really busy with work. And then suddenly, like a bad nightmare, I'd had again and again and again. I was the one chasing him and feeling disgusting and hating myself for it. And then we got coffee and the table between us felt like the Grand Canyon. And while he used to pull me towards him, pick me up in his arms and kiss me like a movie star, he just bent down a little and kissed me like his sister and walked away a ghost. And I knew I would never hear from him again. Kate, I thought you finally learned this with Sean, my best friend Sally said as she hugged me while I sobbed. Sally, whose idea of a successful relationship was a guy remembering her name after a one-night stand or paying for the Uber ride home. She showed up with ice cream and bad advice 33 minutes after I texted her. The guy you want, Kate, he doesn't exist. You would have found him by now. You're better off just being alone. I lay there that night, hugging my pillow. Alone, just like she said. Feeling a raw wound where all my hope used to be. Thinking about Bill, who I met at a drunken party back in college. Or Mark from work, who chased me and chased me until I finally agreed to go out with him. We had three dates, and then he wouldn't talk to me and never looked me in the eye again. Or Chris, who I was even engaged to, who I spent five years with, only two of which were any good, but I didn't want to be alone. So I lay in bed, staring at the ceiling and feeling the tub of ice cream rumble in my belly and the nausea in my heart. And I thought about starting over again and wanted to sob. Going on Tinder or OkCupid or whatever weird dating app people were using these days, since no guys actually just walked up and asked you out anymore. <laughs> And I thought about John and how sincere he seemed and how you couldn't fake looking at a woman like that and wondering what happened, wondering why he pulled away, wondering what I could do to make him want me again, wondering what I could do to make him chase me and hunt me and worship me the way I so desperately wanted him to. Hello, it's Michael, the deep, kind voice said as I stared at a bald guy with penetrating eyes on my computer screen. We were Skyping. I'd been working to talk to him for about three weeks, and I'd tried everything. See, his name is Michael Fiore, and when I'd scoured the internet trying to find out why John pulled away, his name kept on coming up again and again. He'd written some popular books. He'd created these programs you could buy online about getting your ex back and using text messages to bring the romance back, and how to understand the truth about men. I'd even watched this video of him on The Rachel Ray Show and liked his page on Facebook, just like over two million other women. And I hoped and prayed and hoped again he could help me. Hi, Mike. Uh, my name is Kate. And uh, I babbled. I couldn't believe I was finally talking to him. I mean, I'd had to work hard to get this interview. I told him I had a blog and a podcast and wanted to interview him because... Well, because his staff said he was really busy. His staff said 
he didn't do one-on-one -on -one consulting. Hi, Michael. Hi. Hi. Um, it's really nice to meet you, I said. Yeah, you too. So how can I help you? Are we recording? What do you want to talk about? He said, and I felt ice in my heart. What was he going to say if he found out I lied? Um, so I wanted to talk to you about why men pull away, I said. Like, all the women in my, uh, audience talk about this. Like, it starts out great, and then after a few months or years or whatever, things change and you become invisible, he interrupted. Yeah, how'd you, I asked, and he stopped me right away. I get this one a lot, a lot, every day. It's the big question, and it's the question I, uh, what's the name of your show again? I know everybody in this niche, and I've never heard of you, so... Uh, it's, uh, I scrambled for a name. I'm not creative. I never have been. I decided to tell the truth and hope, hope, hope it was okay. Um, I, I don't actually have a show or anything. I'm just a woman from the Midwest, and the tears started to flow. I just don't know what to do. I, I met this guy, and I thought he was different, but he wasn't, and it hurts so much, and... I feel so stupid. I told him the whole story. The whole story about John. The whole story about every man in my whole life. Listen, Kate, I feel for you. You're not stupid. You just fell in love. And I want to help you. I do. But um, do you want me to tell you what you want to hear? Or do you want me to tell you the truth? I felt confused. He was staring right at me. Right through me. What do you mean? I heard defeat in his voice. He suddenly seemed exhausted. I've been doing this a long time. I've helped a lot of women. A lot of women. A lot of men. And a few years ago, I decided I wanted to do something scary. How to make him worship you like the queen you want him to. That's great, I said. How much? I, I don't have much money, but if you let me do a payment plan or something, I... No, that's the thing, Kate. I don't sell it. Not to anyone. I made it, and I invited a few women to look at it, and it didn't go well. It wasn't what they wanted to hear. They got mad, really mad. They couldn't handle it. They wanted the lie and hated me for telling them the truth. A beat. A moment, like he was thinking. I feel for you, Kate, but uh, it's nice meeting you. I need to... He looked away. He was grabbing the mouse. He was turning me away. I want to hear the truth. I want to hear the truth, Michael, whatever it is, no matter how much it hurts. I'm not a little girl anymore. I don't need fantasy. I don't want to be alone. I don't want to have to date again. I don't want to have to date again. <laughs> he bit his lip. He weighed it in his mind. I shouldn't do this, he said. Every guy I know told me I shouldn't even have created this thing. They said it would destroy my career. I'm sorry. I have to go. It's been nice meeting you. Good luck. And then I crawled into bed and cried. I tried creating a new Tinder profile, but every selfie I took, all I could see was the sadness in my eyes. I tried to write Michael again. I sent him messages on Skype. I tried to email his PR people. I'm not proud of it, but I begged. And after three days, something wonderful happened. I got an email from an address I didn't recognize, an email from somebody at Michael's company, Digital Romance, Inc. Kate, hi, you don't know me. I work for Mike. I can help you. I can send you the program Mike talked about. I've been through it. It's tough. It's painful. It goes against everything I thought I knew about men, but it works. It saved my relationship. I'll send it to you, but you have to promise me you won't share it with anyone else promise me. And you have to promise me you'll have an open mind. And you have to promise me you won't tell Mike. And you have to promise me you'll do what it says. I did. It saved my relationship. I want it to save yours too. And I wrote back. I said, yes. Four hours later, I got a link and a login to a website. She was right. It was hard to watch, hard to listen to. There were videos and worksheets and these very specific techniques to use. All this stuff about men's psychology what it's really like to be a man, what men really think of women, and why, really why, they pull away. And my god, it is not what I thought at all. I felt sick the next day, so nervous, like I was standing on a ledge 40 feet up and hoped like hell the bungee cord would stop me from falling to my death. I'd tried texting John a couple times over the last few weeks, but nothing. But this time, I tried something different. I sent him a simple three-word text I learned from Michael and felt my heart in my throat as I hit send. And this time, just 10 minutes later, he answered. 
and he asked me if I wanted to get together for a drink. And instead of being coy or playing games or trying to seduce him, I did what the program said. First, I used the testosterone telepathy technique I'd learned. It's simple, just three words. But he looked at me, confused. He looked me right in the eye, and I saw his jaw relax, and he blinked a few times like he was waking up from a dream. And suddenly, it's like he was there again. That night, he came to my place, and we just cuddled and talked. Over the next few weeks, day by day, I used the program. I printed out the worksheets, I watched the videos over and over. It wasn't what I wanted to be true, but slowly, day by day, doing what it said, accepting that it might be true, it worked. Suddenly, John was texting me again. He was chasing me again. He was looking at me when we went out to dinner. He was telling me how beautiful I was. Over and over, I caught him staring at me with hunger in his eyes. And when he kissed me, it was primal and passionate and deep. And, and before I knew it, he and I were a we. And I suddenly didn't feel very alone at all. What the hell happened to you two? Sally asked as I told her all about my new boyfriend. Did you drug him? Is that it? Because that was over. Like, I was ready to stage an intervention if you ever mentioned his name again. I can't tell you, I said. I just, I learned a few things. What things? Tell me. I held out, at least at first. I'd promised. Promised. Sally is very persistent, but eventually she gave up. She went home. I wrote Anne and told her how grateful I was. And then the next day, I felt ice in my veins and fear in my heart like I was being hunted by an angry tiger. Because my printouts my marked up worksheets, all the amazing techniques and tricks and methods Michael had created and Anne had risked her job to send to me, they were gone. Do you really buy this crap? Sally said when I got her on the phone. You shouldn't have done that. I, I can't believe you. I whisper screamed, not wanting John to hear me from the other room where he was getting ready for work after another blissful night together. This is, this is what you did with John? She asked with sheer disbelief in her voice. Yeah, it works, okay? It worked for me. I was pissed off about it at first, but I'd rather be happy than right, okay? Now give it back, I begged. I will, I will, but I'm gonna try it first with Jeremy. I've been seeing him for a whole two weeks. I want to see what happens when I do this. What have I got to lose besides some not bad sex? She texted me three days later. I can't show you what she said, but it rhymes with holy mitt. <laughs> Jesus, he asked me to go to his brother's wedding with him. What did you say? I asked. I asked him if he was high, and then, then I said yes. We need to make copies. We need to give this to your sister. We need to give this to your mom and Debbie, and I promised, I promised I wouldn't share it, I said. Yeah, you didn't share it. I stole it. Blame me. And that's how it got out. At first, not too far, just eight of our friends. Eight women who used to get together once a week to complain about our crappy relationships and our crappy marriages and how it's impossible to find guys who wanted to actually commit or treat you the way you deserve to be treated. Me, Sally, my friend Amanda, whose husband finally put down his damn phone and looked at her when she learned this one tiny secret, my sister who got her ex to come crawling back on his knees, and four more of our closest friends all giggling like schoolgirls and feeling happy in a way I never thought was possible. And then, Kate? Mike asked, confusion all over his face when he saw me on his screen. Hi, why are we talking again? Then over his shoulder, Anne, is this a mistake or something? Or And then I saw her over his shoulder. Anne and three other women I didn't recognize. Michael's team. Why do I feel like an alcoholic about to have an intervention? He asked. And over the next hour, the five of us sat him down and begged and pleaded and flattered and cajoled. Women can handle the truth, we told him. And we told him about the women it had helped already. Women who were angry and bitter. Women who had given up. You always say your mission is to help women be happy. To help women really understand men, Anne said. This is how you do it, Mike. And he finally said yes. He said we could test releasing his Make Him Worship You program to a small number of women. But only if that small number of women don't drag his name through the mud. If you would listen with an open mind, if you would promise to actually use what you learn. So if you're watching this video, it means you are part of the test. It means you have a chance to learn the devastating, wonderful truth. It means you have a chance to get off the roller coaster of misery most relationships are and have a man actually love and worship you the way you deserve.
but only if you promise right now to forget every fantasy you ever had about what men are supposed to be, to erase every bit of crap you ever learned from Cosmo or any of those other magazines written by 25-year-old interns from your mind, to let go of the pain and bitterness and anger you have towards men who have disappointed you in the past, and to listen and to reserve judgment and to actually try what you learn. If you can do that, this is going to be a life-changing event for you, just like it was for me. But if you can't, well, if you can't, I thank you for your time, but please leave this page right now because we have nothing else to talk about. Still here? If you are, I just need you to say yes to a few important questions before I let you into the club. Are you ready? Ready to learn the actual honest truth about men and the incredibly simple techniques and tricks that will make him not just pay attention to you, but worship you like his personal queen? Ready to finally feel what it's like to relax with a man? To be able to give yourself to him without fear he's going to turn out like all the others and leave you for someone half your age? To feel and know in every fiber of your being that he truly loves you and wants to be with you and only you forever. To feel truly safe and wanted and precious to him. Are you ready for him to put down his damn cell phone and actually listen and pay attention and really be present with you because you are his absolute priority? To be his sexual obsession. To feel his eyes on you every time you walk across the room. To have him pull you close instead of pushing you away. If you're still watching this, if you felt yourself nodding along and wanting to feel like this, if you're brave enough to want to hear the actual truth, even if it's not what you want to be true, then it means the answer is yes, 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 yes. So here we go. Take a deep breath. Here's just a tiny sample of the life-changing techniques, truths about men, and amazing results you're going to almost automatically get when you join the tiny number of women allowed to try out Michael's Make Him Worship You program today. First, Michael will open your eyes to the secret emotional life of men, why men are terrified to tell you the truth about what they feel, and how to get him to finally open his heart and be completely vulnerable with you just by whispering four simple heart opener words in his ear. Warning, hearing these simple words can cause a flood of instant emotion to rush through a man. It's incredibly important you only say these words to him when in a private and safe place and in a very specific tone of voice. If you're like me, you probably find yourself wondering every day where all the real men went. Well, you'll be shocked when Michael teaches you about the crisis of masculinity, why it seems impossible to find real men these days, and how to find the powerful, strong, sexy men hiding right under your nose and in disguises that you won't believe. Sick of being the one who has to initiate sex? Of feeling unwanted or undesired? Of feeling like he'd rather watch porn than be with the real woman right here in front of him? Those days are over forever. Because next, you'll learn how to use your fingernails to unleash his inner caveman, instantly spiking his testosterone through the roof, igniting a flash of desire in his eyes, and having him dragging you toward the bedroom with a goofy grin plastered across your face, feeling like the most wanted woman in the world. Sometimes feel like you're with a boy instead of a man. Michael will teach you how to trigger his primal provider drive, so even the laziest guy who spends all day smoking pot and playing video games finds himself overwhelmed by sudden ambition and an astonishing desire to be a man truly worthy of your admiration, worthy of your respect, and worthy of you. Next, you'll learn the master male emotion the one feeling men are taught they're allowed to feel, and how to use your testosterone telepathy to read his masculine mind and discover his secret heart. You'll learn how to unleash the astonishing power of feminine softness and the man-melting hug that makes his heart open to you like a flower. You'll get an astonishing collection of psychologically tested seduction words and phrases that rewire his brain for love and commitment. The anger deflator technique that stops fights in their tracks and deflates anger from him like air from a balloon. Here's an important one. The one poisonous question you must never ask a man if you want to keep him devoted to you. This simple question seems like nothing at all to women, but let it escape your lip and it will build like a poison in his heart until it's impossible for him to ever truly love you again. The truth about masculine shame, why most guys constantly feel like they're failing as men, and how to make him feel like an alpha male with just one look. 
Why everything you've learned from Yoda is utterly wrong, and why most men have given up trying to be a good husband or boyfriend six months or a year into your relationship. The hypnotic kiss technique that makes the very idea of being with another woman absolutely disgust him. Want him to want to spend more time with you? It sounds impossible, but simply do this one kind of odd thing the first time you see him in the morning to have him eager to shop for furniture, go to a museum, take you out for dinner, or just going for a walk and talking and actually thanking you for it. Feeling taken for granted and unappreciated for everything you do for him, you'll learn how to inspire him to brag about you in public so every friend of yours is gnawing their heart out with thinly disguised jealousy. You won't believe how wonderful it feels when your girlfriends are begging you to tell them your secret. How you made your man so devoted. What trick you used to make him so astonishingly proud to be your man. The future fantasy method that has him planning your life together, fantasizing about growing old with you. Experience connection and love with you most women would never dare dream of. What it actually means when he can't perform and why it has nothing to do with how attracted he is to you and how to make him feel comfortable, relaxed, and ready for you with nothing but a smile and a subtle change of voice. What men really want from women that they will never tell you even under the threat of torture, because they've been taught their whole lives that what we want is wrong, and that you'll freak out if you learn the truth. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. You'll also discover masculine sex signals and how to get him to sweep you off your feet and flat out seduce you in a way you thought only happened in romance novels. How to criticize a guy in a way he can actually hear and how to use the shields down method to make it impossible for him to get defensive and truly listen to you. How to give him permission to cry so all his masculine posturing falls away and you discover the soft and wonderful man inside. And much more than I have time to lay out here all as done for you as possible, so all you have to do is follow a few instructions that are simpler than pumping your own gas. Okay, can you feel that? Your heart beating, the dryness in your mouth, that incredible desire to know this, to be able to do this, to have this power, to have that one special man need you and only you like this. To feel not just loved, but worshiped by him like a queen, like a goddess, like his one true love. How much is it worth to have all this at your fingertips? How much is it worth to have him fall in love with you and stay in love with you for as long as you want? How much is it worth to never have to settle for a guy because you know there is an endless supply of men who would chew off their own leg to be with you? How much is it worth to know he has given you his heart, his love, his devotion, and that it is yours forever if you just follow these simple steps? Honestly, having gone through the program myself, Having felt for myself how this material changed my life and helped me escape dating hell, I would have happily paid thousands of dollars for this, even though I'm nowhere near rich. I mean, how much would it really be worth to you to know the secret to making any man want to commit so you can stop going through the hell of dating and spend the rest of your life in love? To make your boyfriend chase you and want you and need you like this, even if he feels like a ghost to you now. To have your husband wake up to the amazing woman who has been there under his nose the whole time. I don't want to bring you down here, but I see so many women every day in misery because they don't understand men. They drag their boyfriends or husbands to couples counseling, which costs thousands of dollars, does absolutely nothing to give you the attention and connection and pleasure you deserve. Or women who complain about being alone, who spend so much money on dating sites and fancy clothes, but who just don't understand masculine psychology, what men truly desire, what inspires men to want to be the love and lover you've wanted for so long. So think about that for a second. Keep that solid in your head. Think about how knowing this, how having these tools will change your entire future with men, just like they did for me. How it will keep your current relationships from ending in bitterness and pain the way all the others did. How it will make sure you never make the same mistakes again. How it will keep him faithful. And then ask yourself, what do you think would be a fair price to make him worship you forever? Is it hundreds of dollars? Is it thousands? 
Can you even put a price on it? On being as happy as I wake up every day and see my man laying there next to me, knowing he's going to treat me like a goddess for the rest of my life? If you're being completely honest, I bet you'd say $297 or more would be an incredibly cheap price to pay to finally be loved and adored and wanted the way you've always deserved. Heck, I bet you'd think that was cheap to never have to feel that pain and disappointment again. To never have to wonder about how he really feels about you because you can feel the passion and desire and love emanating off him like heat from a stove. I mean, $297 is a lot of money, but considering this is a power you'll carry with you for the rest of your life and will change the way men treat you forever, well, when you look at it that way, it sounds really cheap, doesn't it? But you know what? I get it. I know that even when you want something so much and know it's a once-in-a-lifetime deal, as a woman who spent so much of your life giving and giving and giving to others, sometimes it feels impossible to be selfish and give yourself what you so desperately need. Which is why I flat out begged Michael to let me offer you Make Him Worship You at a discounted price that I'm honestly shocked he agreed to. We've already agreed that learning how to make any man you want utterly worship you is worth at least $297. And honestly, it's worth a lot more than that. But because you've stuck with me through my whole story, because you've shown me you'd rather be happy than right, I've begged and pleaded with Michael, and he's agreed to let a very small number of women test out Make Him Worship You at a tiny fraction of that price. Which means if you act right now, you won't pay $297. You won't pay $197, though, I think you'll agree that would be a total steal. You won't even pay $97. I've put myself on the line with Michael here. As long as this video is up and Michael could demand I take it down at any moment, you'll get the complete Make Him Worship You program for the discounted price of just $37. Immediate action discount. And all you have to do to secure this incredible discount is click the button below this video right now. That's the good news. The bad news is, to lock in your discount, you have to act right now. Why? Because after working so hard on this program, sharing secrets he swore he would never share with anyone again, Michael feels like $37 is just way too cheap, and that to fulfill his mission to help as many women as possible, he may need to double or even triple the price to something more reasonable. If you're still seeing this video, it means he's still testing to find out if he can make the numbers work with your incredible discount. But he could change his mind at any time. So please, if you come back in a few hours or tomorrow and the price is higher, maybe much higher, please don't write me begging. If you pass up on your one chance to lock in your discount now, there's simply nothing I can do for you. Oh, and just to take away every excuse your brain can come up with not to do this for yourself, Michael is going to back everything with a frankly incredible 100% 60-day money-back guarantee. Here's how it works. Just enroll in Make Him Worship You right now, use the material, it's so easy to use and as close to done for you as humanly possible, see for yourself how easy it is to have the relationship you've always dreamed of when you know these secrets. If you don't think Make Him Worship You is worth at least five times what you're paying today, just contact Michael's customer service team at support at digitalromanceinc.com anytime in the next 60 days and you'll get every dime back as fast as humanly possible. Which means you get to try out everything in Make Him Worship You and see the results it's going to get for you basically for free. And all you have to do to take advantage of Michael's generosity is click the button below this video now. Okay, if you're not convinced yet, if there's still a little voice in the back of your head that isn't quite sure, let me do one more thing to make this the easiest choice of your life and to make sure you don't let fear of regret keep you from taking advantage of this wonderful offer. See, I want you to feel deep in your heart and deep in your soul that you're getting an incredible deal that you can be proud of. That's why I've got three very special presents for you just for saying maybe to make him worship you today. And these presents are yours forever. Even if you decide the main program isn't for you and take advantage of Michael's no questions asked guarantee. First, you'll get Michael's special When to Sleep with a Man report, which answers the biggest and most dangerous question affecting your dating life. So you'll know exactly when to give in to your desires to beat the hook with a man. 
So he sees it as more than just sex and becomes absolutely addicted to you. Your next present is called Unstoppable Confidence, where you'll hear over 90 minutes of deep conversation between Michael Fiore and Michael Griswold, teaching you how to use feminine vulnerability to wrap any man you want around your finger. The third present is something a bit shocking. In fact, I can't give this to everyone, but if you act right now, you'll get The Good Girl's Guide to Texting Dirty. Every woman I know has been caught staring at her cell phone and wondering what to say to a man when he wants to get a little dirty. That's why I'm giving you dozens of done-for-you texts that use secrets of male psychology to have him sexually obsessed with you in seconds. So let's add all this up just so you can see for yourself what a great deal you're actually getting. With your special discount, you'll get the complete Make Him Worship You program for just $37. We already agreed that Make Him Worship You is worth at least $97 all by itself, and honestly, it's worth a lot more than that. So that's already a pretty great deal. But then at no additional charge at all, you're also getting When to Sleep with a Man, Unstoppable Confidence, and The Good Girl's Guide to Texting Dirty. And each of those should probably sell for $97 or more all by themselves, too. If you were at the supermarket, that would all add up to $388. But using your special discount, which Michael could decide to stop offering at any time, you'll get everything for just $37. I don't know about you, but if I was at the store, swiped my membership card, and saw my bill for $400 worth of stuff plummet to less than $50, I'd feel like I won the lottery. Or like there was some mistake. But no matter what, I'd rush to claim my discount before anyone tried to take it away. And all you have to do to claim your discount and take advantage of this amazing deal is click the big button right below this video right now. Then fill in your payment details using a credit card, debit card, or PayPal on the next page. Once you do, you'll get your unique login credentials so you can access Make Him Worship You on your phone, tablet, or computer anywhere you want, anytime you need it. Just click the button below this video right now. Pay your severely discounted enrollment fee, go through the program, learn the secrets of the masculine mind and the masculine heart to make him yours and only yours for as long as you want him. Use these tested and proven techniques. Feel what it's like to have his complete attention whenever you want it, to have him chase you, to have him truly worship you, clutching you hard against him because he is so desperate not to let you get away, connecting and communicating with you in a way that sends shocks of delight through every cell of your body. Experience what it's like to be in control with men to finally be the one deciding if you want to give him any more of your precious time. Instead of feeling like you're an emotional desert begging him to give you one drop of the love and attention you need. Feel a level of real, natural confidence that fills your entire body. If you're anything like me or the other women who have used this program, you're going to be amazed at the change in your life and the change in you once you learn this. How men you meet just look at you differently. A profound curiosity flashing across his eyes. How even men you don't know find themselves nervous and excited just to talk to you. If you're like me, you're going to have a hard time wiping that goofy smile off your face or keeping that joyous sparkle out of your eyes or keeping your mouth shut when other women ask to know your secret that created such a change in seemingly overnight. Okay, it's time to take action. You might not know it, at least not consciously, but you're at an important crossroads in your life right now. And you really just have two very different options, leading to two very different lives. One of romance, passion, connection, and fun, where you enjoy a serious, committed relationship with a man who truly loves and adores and, yes, worships you. The other, well, the other is just a continuation of the life you have now. So closely listen as I tell you what your two options are so you can make the right choice for you. Option one is to leave this page without enrolling in the program and try to forget everything you've learned in this presentation. Go back to a life of disappointment, either settling for a relationship that doesn't fulfill you or bouncing from man to man every few months or every few years, hoping this time will be different. Or resigning yourself to being single forever, that men are scum, that the dream you had of lasting love is never going to happen. I know you don't want that. I know you are so sick of feeling that, of pretending it doesn't bother you, of yearning for real connection, real love, real passion with a man who sees the real you and just wants more and more and more. Which is why I want you to take a second here and seriously consider taking road number two. In a lot of ways, it's the easier road because all it takes on your part is deciding you love yourself enough to say yes right now. 
Simply click the button below this video, enter your payment information right now before life gets in the way, and claim your spot in the Make Him Worship You program. Get every single thing I've talked about in this video and quite a few surprises I haven't even mentioned, but I can't wait for you to see. Learn how to get him to chase you now and forever, to slay dragons just to see a smile on your face, to beg to be your man because of how amazing you make him feel, to do everything he possibly can to show you how important you are to him. Remember, with your 60-day guarantee, you're risking absolutely nothing. In fact, all the risk is completely on Michael. And with your special discount, you're paying just a tiny fraction of the real value of the program. And I can't say this firmly enough. You'll pay your discounted enrollment fee today and will be locked in with access to the program for life without ever paying another dime. No fine print, no hidden charges. Whether you're single right now and wondering if your prince will ever come, or you're a few months or years in and can feel him pull away or have been with your man for years and years and feel ignored feel invisible that pain is over and all you have to do is make a tiny easy decision right now michael has already done all the work for you he's opened the door to you truly understanding men He's created the Owner's Manual to Men, a set of lesson and techniques that will give you magic powers to finally have the love you want so much. All you have to do is walk through that door. I hope you understand just how much the deck has been stacked in your favor so you literally can't lose. Actually, there is one way you can lose. By letting doubt and cynicism get in the way of love and passion you want so much that you deserve so much. I've done everything I can to convince Michael to give you this opportunity, but only you can take that final step toward a happier and so much more connected relationship with men. To make your husband, your boyfriend, or even a man you just met become completely addicted to you so even the idea of being with another woman makes him sick. Just click the button below, relax, and accept the help you need to finally have the passion and love and power you crave so deeply. I personally promise you'll be very happy you did. Because I'm so happy I did. I'm so happy I learned what Michael had to teach, used what he taught me, and got off the disappointment roller coaster for good. In fact, I have a nightmare sometimes. A nightmare where I didn't trust my gut and learn what Michael had to teach me, where things with John and I ended just like they did with every guy before. Whenever I have that nightmare, I wake up in a cold sweat, terrified I've gone back to that life. Then I look at John laying next to me, the man I use techniques and make him worship you with every day to keep him developed devoted, even addicted to me, and I smile, cuddle up to him, feel the steady thump of his heartbeat as he pulls me in close, and go back to sleep more content and happy than I've ever been. I want you to feel that too, and you can, but only if you click the button below and enroll in Make Him Worship You right now before it's too late. My name is Kate Murray, and I'm incredibly excited for you to join me in experiencing what happens when you apply Make Him Worship You in your life. I can't wait to hear about your success. Thank you for your time. Simply click the button below, secure your spot now.